The striped bass, the most prolific game fish in America. They actually call them America's game fish. This is a fish that I grew to love during my time in Massachusetts when I lived there for five years. Since returning to Florida, I still plan annual trips to the Northeast to make sure that I get my stripes in because I am absolutely addicted to targeting them. Very similar to the Florida species of snook, they're super ferocious eaters. They eat on top, they eat on the jig, they eat live bait, and they're extremely versatile. They taste delicious, they jump, they shake their heads, and there's nothing that you shouldn't love about them. I went up to Buzzards Bay in Massachusetts, one of the most prolific striped bass fisheries in the world, and I spent some time with my good friend Captain Robbie putting in the work to produce a top water personal best. But that's not all. We caught tons of fish and it was an absolutely epic trip. I hope you guys enjoy this video as much as I did making it. No way I got that. Come on. Yeah. Big fish. Yeah, got it. Oh my god, giant dude. Freaking giant dude. What is happening, y'all? Welcome back to a very special episode of A Ben's Fishing. I am here with my man, Captain Robbie. This guy has fished with some of the best creators like John B, Ryan is, but not only that, he's an amazing guide. And we are up here in Cape Cod, Massachusetts, and we're gonna be focused on Buzzards Bay. So I am super stoked to bring this to you, and I wanna give a huge shout out to Saltwater Sportsman for sponsoring yet another adventure for my channel. The goal today is pretty simple. We're just gonna try to get some stripers. We're gonna try to get with plugs or yes, live sir. bait. Yes, sir, it's gonna be mainly a plug things right now. We got the side scan going with our hummingbird units. We're gonna go look for big groups of fish, cast the plugs over them, and see who wants to come up and have some fun. Dude, that is super simple, and that's what I like to see. Believe it or not, I lived in Massachusetts for five years working. I never got on a boat my entire life. I was just a canal rat, meaning I fished the Cape Cod Canal up and down every day of my life like an idiot, and I never actually went out and explored. So I'm super, super stoked to fish around here. And I'm gonna stop talking, let's get some lines and water, let's do this. Thank you guys so much for support, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Dude, you're talking to the top water guy. That's yeah, that's awesome. That's like my life. All right, y'all. So we are going to be using this. Uh, I think it's called a Robbie Rice Daddy Mac. It's a nine-inch spook, white spook. Seems to be really tail heavy, almost like a pencil. And the way we're gonna hook it up is just with a standard uh, modified loop knot. Um, this is not a knot tying video at all, but people always ask how I hook things up, so I use a loop knot. Basically, you just make a little circle. If you can see it, great. If you can't, I'm sorry. And then I just wrap it three times. This is 50 pound test, so that should be sufficient. Put it back to the little circle. And then just uh, cinch that baby down, man. And there you go, you got your loop knot, modified loop knot. So I'll talk about the setup as we get fishing, but Captain Robbie already marked some, so I'm pretty stoked about this. I hope we get on them, and if we don't, it's all right. It's just a good day on the water. All right, guys, so the name of the game is Cast With The Wind and make really long casts and just spook. I've never used this spook, but it looks like it's walking pretty damn good. We marking them? Oh yeah. We're marking them. Same deal, right? Just keep casting with the wind? Yep, just keep casting. Don't raise one. I can launch it, bro. Should I just launch, launch it? it? As far as you can. The longer the cast, the better the catch. <laughs> I mean, I knew I could launch it. This spook is really tail heavy, so. Use that distance to your advantage, trust me. Especially Just... when they're like, like you'll be surprised how finicky they still are right now, even in this wind. Like we're marking them pretty good. You're probably over a lot of fish right now. Still got a couple on that side. I swear, I, I knew I had one, bro. I knew I had a fall. Oh, it's a freaking monster. Oh come, on. come on, come on. Come on. Oh, I'll dude. I knew I had, bro, I was about to say, I think yeah. there's one on me. That was epic. Guys, just got whacked by a giant, dude. Oh, that 
that was me. That was my bad. I stopped spooking to look. And uh, I, I shit the bed on that. I did. Guys, that was a giant. Yeah, that was a giant. I thought he was going to hit it boat side. That would have been so epic. But I got a good look at that fish. That was a, that was big. Big fish. I could spook it a little more erratically to kind of call them up, make some noise. That's what I do for the jacks. So sometimes yeah. when they sit low like that, I gotta just get almost work it like a pencil. Yeah. One of my favorite things to do is when it hits the water, is like really erratically work it for the first like ten yards of the cast, and then slow it down. It's oh yeah, I got hit. I just got hit. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. I missed it. I'm not positive if I didn't just go into a wave or not, but. I mean, you'll, usually you know. <laughs> you'll, you'll hit it like that one did right there. It'll either be that, or there'll be a big wake behind it, or there'll be a huge, like a huge circular boil as well. Come on, Daddy Mac Lures. All right, guys, set up for the day. Since I didn't bring much of my own gear, all I brought was two of these reels, AL 13 6.0s by 13 Fishing. And then I actually scooped this rod that I've been eyeing for like five years. This is the most expensive rod I've ever personally bought myself. And it's made by Black Hole. So I'm sponsored by 13, and I have nothing but good things to say about all their product. But unfortunately, when you're fishing in the Northeast and doing what I'm gonna be doing a lot of this trip, which is surf casting, especially surf casting the canal, you almost need a rod that's just specifically designed for that. And these guys over at Black Hole do that. I have no affiliation, but this is called the Striped Bass Special. It's a nine foot, two piece hybrid surf casting boat rod. So typically at the Cape Cod Canal, people use 11 foot rods, huge rods, but I've never liked doing that because I feel like it limits where I'm able to cast. And then again, this is like a hybrid, but it's, it's, tech, it's more of a surf rod than it is a boat rod. But I'm excited to put some freaking fish on it. It's perfect for what we're doing, casting as far as we can and trying to pull that plug back against the wind. Guys, all this is bass. All of that is, that's, that's the densest mark we might have seen. These yep. two, that's insane. Pretty cool. Guys, I just switched to the old school Sabeel Magic Swimmer. I'm using a fast sinking one. I don't. I think it's like seven inches. They, they make so many different sizes. I really didn't look, I just put it on. This is basically like a glide bait in a way. It's uh, three different pieces. It. Guys, just got whacked, dude. Pretty close, too. So I switched my retrieve to a very moderately paced retrieve. No jerks, no nothing. And uh, he followed it right up. Wasn't a huge fish like that first one, but it was still a quality fish. So definitely a slot to maybe just over. That was first cast, too, in this spot. There we go. We're on. We're on. We're on. Tight. Yep. Tight. Oh, nice Good fish. Testing out the new rod. It's nothing crazy, but hey, it's a start. Swimming with me. Did it. Swimming with me. Might have some followers behind her. Oh, yeah, it does. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a bunch with her. Send it. Oh, my God. There's so many with her. Send it. Robbie's going to send the spook right there. There's like five fish behind her. Watch this, guys. Watch this, dude. Watch this. Oh, he's getting hit. <laughs> oh, he's getting hit. Oh, dude. Unfreaking believable. This thing had so many followers. I'm going to boat flipper. Well, we found some willing participants. First striper of the trip. Nothing crazy, but... Uh, it's a start, that's for sure. Guys, that's a beautiful fish, nothing big, but appreciate them all. Robbie's got me beat good. But I'm gonna get another one in, cause this is a good fish. Let's get a shot of that with the freaking dock in its mouth. She was literally following. Dude, let's do this. I'm gonna switch to the top water again if he starts to show me up. Cause there's nothing like a top water eat. They seem to all be like where we were just casting. That 
caught such a big fish, man. Robbie just had like a 40 pounder hit. That was crazy. That, that was crazy, bro. Oh my God, dude, big fish, big fish, yeah. Yes, dude, we're on, dude, switch. They want the top water, bro. I was throwing the swimmer and they did not want that swimmer. It's not as big as I think that the hit was just ferocious. Not at all as big as, as the one that hit yours. There's some behind me, bro. Oh, I don't know where they went. They just dispersed. There was like three again. So epic. They're just falling. Let me go to the back. Small, but... Oh, yeah. I mean, big, way bigger than the last. Oh, I brought a boga. I got it up front. Oh, that's the way to do it. Perfect rear treble. I got my bail open. Hey, out there, buddy. Sick. Look at that. He's a rear hook. Sick. I'm gonna get a shot out on my GoPro. Oh, you, you want can to take it out. We'll okay. get another one. Okay. We're gonna get another one. Uh, 28 to 31. That's probably really close. Really close, yeah. All right, let's send her back. Let's get another one. We're marking. We got overcast too, which is beautiful. Oh God, did you see that? That was a huge oh blow up. God. Oh God, dude, just got whacked. We both just got whacked at the same time. I got one on me. That was a huge blow up on me, bro. Oh my God, he's he's getting he's getting circled by a nicer fish. That might be a blue fish. That is a blue, I think. No, listen, no, the big bass love hanging near the blue fish. I definitely had a huge fish hit. I don't know if it was a blue. So I'm swirled, I'm swirled, I'm okay. swirled. There we go. Fish on. The size is ridiculous right now. We might have found some blues, guys. Let's see if I got a bass or a blue. I got a bass. Nice. Nice bass. My biggest of the day. He's digging. Not a bad fish, Aaron. Not bad at all. All right, guys, this one put up a freaking fight. You're good. That's a good fish, guys. 15 pounds. That's a fun size fish right there. Guys, check that out. It's a nice 15 pound striped bass on the Mega Spook. Couldn't ask for anything else. I'm gonna get her back and then uh, hopefully get another one. Guys, one more shot in case the first one wasn't good. Nice striped bass. That's what we come to Cape Cod for. Let's get a nice release here. Head dive. All right, guys, we just reset our drift. The name of the game is really just drift. Utilize some side imaging to try to find out where you should be drifting and then just doing a little drift, man. The tides in the Northeast are so strong. I think a lot of people from down South or wherever you're from, if you're not from here, you don't realize that they get, you know, six to eight foot tide swings on a daily basis. So these fish and this water's moving so much. A lot of guys around here don't use trolling motors as often because you can just drift because the current is constantly so strong everywhere you are.
Guys, we're marking, but I'm sorry about the wind noise. If you're watching this clip, just know it's worth it, all right? If you're watching this clip, I'm about to catch a freaking beast. Dude. On that side now? Yeah. No. The fish that just followed me was big. Don't give up on that cat yet. I won't. I like retrieving on this side more. It retrieves better. We'll discuss. Yeah, we'll discuss it. Yeah, we'll discuss it. I'll, uh, I'll let you know when we get out some water. We'll spend a little more time. I'm going to find a couple of people. Okay. Good job. Oh my god, giant dude! Freaking giant dude! Giant! Oh! Giant dude! Oh my god! Bro! Oh my god, bro! I was trolling the spook! Oh! Dude! Guys, I was trolling the spook. I'm sorry about the wind noise. I gotta chill with this. Lock up my drag a little. This is a giant fish, guys. He smoked the top water. I hope I got that heat for you guys. It's so heavy. My drag is tight, and every time I even lift it, dude, he takes drag. Woo, he's big. That first run was insane. I kept his head up though. We good with the motors here? Oh. <laughs> he said striper don't fight. My drag is so tight. Oh my God. That thing just ran his freaking heart out. Woo, dude, this one, I was trolling the spook, not even reeling, just. Really? With yeah. The, with the wind? With the, with the bow, with, with the, the drift. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. That thing smoked it. That was sick. This is a fish, man. Ho 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 ho. Giant, dude. It's giant. Oh, big, very large, very large. Hooked really good. I thought it was a little bigger, but hey, that's got to be 40 inches. Got her? Oh. Dude, on freaking real, man, on the top water, dude. All right, my bail's open. I'll reel some of this slack in. What a giant thanks to Captain Robbie, dude. He literally okay, said it would guys. happen at the end of the day. Oh my God. You want, mind getting a shot for me up on the deck? Absolutely. I'm just going to leave it recording so you don't have to press yeah, anything. One second. I'm just going to secure this. Want to see how much it weighs? Yeah, sure. That might go through. 30 pounds. 30 pounds. 30 pounder. 30 pounder. 31 even. 31 even. Money. Yeah. Be money right here. Feel free to tell me if my hold looks bad. That's pretty good. Guys, that is a 31 pound striped bass, dude. On the top water, made it happen. It's probably 44, 45 inches, but just so healthy, so fat. We're gonna get a good release. So let's get that. There. All right, guys. Pretty good, I'm recording. <sighs> Revive big girl a little. Get that tail. There we go. She's off. See ya. Went straight down deep. Woo! Nice job, bro. Thanks, dude. Heck yeah. That was it. Dude. So I just right out here. Yep. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh my god, it's dying. Oh my god. Falling up. Come on, you gotta eat it. Look at that. Guys, they're all over Robbie's plug. They're all over his plug. He didn't get it? No. I don't know where my plug even is. Dude, that was epic. He's still on it. Oh, he's a boy. Oh my God. Dude, he's got, I'm a giant, right. giant, giant. giant. Oh, wait a minute. Mine's a monster. Robbie's on a monster. There's a giant on me. Come on, eat it at the boat, eat it at the boat. 
Eat it at the boat. Come on. Oh. No way. Guys, the screen is painted with giant fish. That's what Robbie just said. Mine's a 30 pounder all day. He's got a 30 pounder on. I just had three hits. Where at? Everywhere. Everywhere. Behind. There's not one part of the park that has no Are you kidding me? And I'm not getting one? Come on. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Here comes a fish. I got so throttled at the same time. Still marking? Yeah, I think they're all on the other side of us now. Okay. Go the other way. Try it. Burn it in and go? Yep. Dude, they're fired up for that sunset shoe. Yeah, bro. That was crazy. Yeah, they're up here. Oh my god, dude, giant, giant, giant! Oh, 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 oh. oh my god! Dude, this one is huge, bro. Bigger than the last. I gotta come under you here if you don't mind. Go right back out there. Come on. Guys, I am freaking out. That was such a big eat. You need me to do anything with the boat? Like put it in. No, you're good. Barely Drift into the rock. Are we near the rocks right now? We're so close. Oh shit. Might need your help. Here. Come back here. Oh my god, it just followed her all the way. Here, here, I'll, I'll handle the fish. You get the boat. Right. I got this. Okay. Oh, he spit the freaking dock. Here, here, here. Here, yeah, you got him? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh shit, we were way too close. Sorry, dude. This is you're good, I got it, I got it. You got him? Yeah, I got it. Alright, You're good. <laughs> Guys, that was wild. Oh my god, that was wild. Do you see those rocks? We just about hit them. Robbie, your fish is... Alright, 24, 25? 26. Yeah. That. Guys, 26 pounder, and I, I mean, we had giants on us, guys. Absolute hogs. Beautiful fish. Heck yeah. Absolutely epic, dude. Sweet, man. Oh my God. Let's get some more. We can probably double up right now. Oh, dude. All right, Joe, we are back super early, earlier than I'd like to wake up to get back out with Robbie for day two. And the plan today is to try to catch some bunker and then use a mix of bunker and top water. We really made it happen yesterday at the end of the day and then Robbie got hyped because he was saying the pattern's gonna continue today. It is currently 4.34 a.m. So this isn't like Florida where the sun rises at 6.30. The sun's already starting to rise, right? Yes. And we have tons of fog, so we're not even gonna see it very well. But anyways, guys, if you can't see the low light, it's because it's like literally four in the morning, but Let's do this, let's get into it. We got Bruna behind the camera today. So Bruna the hammer is gonna put some on the deck and let's see what we can get. y'all we are back at it on the water and uh yeah we're actually fishing like the west end of the canal kind of like where i fish from land so often and uh we're just trying to throw plugs trying to throw top water 
you know, trying to see if we can call them up. It's pretty deep, but there are fish here. Surprisingly good water clarity. We've had some falls already. Get some really good fish in there. Uh, oh, yeah. got one, big one, big one, big one. Yeah. Yeah. I know exactly where that happened and how it happened though. He's trying to put the pogey in the strike zone. So what happens if we go more in here? It's just closer to the west end? Yeah, no, this is where I, this is where you want to be. Especially for this type of thing. When you go up more up there, it'll, it's like super deep. It's more of a jig fight. Right? Okay. It's like the best top water action. What I'm thinking is I want, oh yeah, nice fish, dude. Yeah, fuck that thing? yeah, got it. Got it, got it, got it. It's not big though, it's no, a schoolie. It's Exactly. Well, not yet, but we will. I'm landing it. No, not at all. Yeah, send in that rip. I like this because I did have some wind noise in my camera yesterday. It's just yeah. inevitable. Oh, definitely. Guys, check this out. These things just, I mean, this is probably what, a 28 to 30 incher? Yeah, probably 28, 29 inch fish. Yeah, I'll let, I'll let Robbie. Huh? Not a bad one though. Good start to the morning. We have a, oh, you have a fish, fish right under her plug. See that? Yeah, yeah. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. That's pretty wild. Huh? Send it back. Send it back. Send it back. Yeah, oh yeah, they are. Send it. Send it. Send it. Go. Go, baby. All right, y'all. We're switching up our tactic a little from the artificial, and uh, we're actually using good old-fashioned Atlantic Manhattan, aka Bunker, aka Pogi, and uh, I'm just putting the hook right in here, right through the top. And we're using these bait runners that Cap is running. Come on, kick up. Kick up. You were just so spunky. Yeah, I did. Here. Get a pitch. Really? Yeah, that was a while ago though. That was a 23 inch. Oh, there's no button. Send it. The ladies, man, the ladies. Uh oh. Careful, you might get it. I think you just got thumped. Oh yeah, here, here, here. Take it, babe. Me? Yeah, take it. Wait, wait. He's on. Come tight. Come tight, come tight. She's on. Big fish. Really big fish. Right. Really big fish. Really big fish. <laughs> yeah, yeah, keep it, keep it off the rock. on a giant dude come on camp come up this way why is this not working okay there we go all right guys Bruno's on a freaking tanker like yeah yeah keep him at the top 
Step onto the bow. Step onto no, the bow. Yeah, guy. Sorry about the rocking, guys. It ain't it ain't the best conditions, but. Oh, there's water on the lens. Sorry about the water on the lens, guys. I gotta switch to the GoPro. This is not happening. It's too uh too moist out here. Moist. That's not good. Right here. That's not good. Take your time. Just keep that bed. You gotta work hard for this fish. You're gonna get rewarded here. Should we try to double up? We're not in the zone anymore, are we? Uh no, we're not in a bad spot. Yeah, let's try to double up there. I like that. Actually, you know what? Let me help her. Let me keep recording. Let me. Sorry, guys, about the. It's extremely foggy, as you can see. Very low visibility. Very rocky. Your boy gets seasick. So for me. Okay, I'm good. I'm not gonna fall off the boat. You're not gonna be cold anymore, babe. I'm sweating now. No boat in rocks. Keep it up. Keep it up. Come up, come up, come up, come up to the bow. No, I'm not going up there. Sea deck. Oh, yeah. come it's down sea to deck. Come down to me. I don't want to pull the hook. You might, you might. All right, yeah, if you have to go up there, walk. You're good. Hold on to her. Here it comes again. Come down to me. Nice and easy. Do the shuffle. Big here. fish. 25, 30 pounds. Uh -huh. All right. You're good here. That's a new PB. There it is. Woo! Check that's that out, guys. Ever, right? uh, there. Here, you want to bring it to the wow. top? So heavy. <laughs> yeah. Look oh at God, that. Look at that, dude. Give me a smile. <laughs> oh my God, dude. So freaking epic. How do you feel, babe? Uh, not cold. Ah, so insane. <laughs> Getting a good release on these fish. Let them go, let them grow. I mean, it's an overslot anyway, so. That's a big old head. She's off. Good job. Heck yeah. Oh, dude, I just got whacked. Yeah. Big fish. Big fish on, yeah. Big. Big. What pound test is on this? Because this is huge. Nah, but I don't want him to get down. It's yeah. huge, bro. Oh. Might have been down. Did you feel rocks at all? No. Okay. That was just the fish, bro. That one was huge. There's a lot of big fish here. I think it broke. Yeah. Dude, what the heck? No, now you're worried about that. Oh my God, that's a freaking tank. Now you're worried about that. Oh, guys, Bruna just got smoked. Nice job. Let's double up. That's a freaking giant, dude. Holy smokes, dude. Yeah, they do that. It's like a mix of redfish and snook. Oh, he's heavy. Heavy. Big fish. Giant fish. Don't rush him. Ah, 
to step to the bow. Dude, two giants just followed me to the boat. Really? Yeah. Guys, right, Bruno just had a he, she still has the giant on. Sorry, we're trying to double up. And uh, he got put in the boulders and he swam himself out. Now he's at the surface. But man, this thing is huge, guys. She might beat my PB. Holy smokes. Is that him all the way out there? Yeah. No, he's, he's right here. Yeah, he's probably about 50 yards off the side. Yeah. Might need to have to make a bogey run again. I'm down. We'll do it when this tide dies oh. out and then awesome to meet me and Demetrius. Let's will see come this back. fish. Oh, Dude! Not that big. Just, no, he's big, just built me. different. Big fish. Probably big similar, maybe a little smaller to be honest. Maybe 26. It's gonna be high 20 pounds. Nah, he's just freaking fat, and he swallowed it. Oh, it's okay. You can get that out easy. Yeah. It's probably just in the mouth, not like actually down the throat. No, so what we do is we just cut. Oh no, it's not. It's just oh, in no, the mouth. Perfect. It's literally just choked it. Oh, nice this one, fish. Hang on, let me clean my lens. Another, another 40 plus incher. I mean, probably 26 pounds. Actually, probably. Let's see. 20, 26 pounds, yeah. Yeah, you can tell it's a little smaller, but just sometimes they throw down. Like, not all fish fight the same. You want to hold her? Yeah. That's what just happened. Uh, well, we were throwing bunker. This girl just came up and inhaled it and just took us for a ride right by the rocks. We almost lost her, but we got her back in. Nice. All right, let's get a release. <laughs> <Perfect>. <laughs>